Hey, what's going on everybody on YouTube? How's everybody doing? I'm doing just fine. Doing awesome actually. So today, welcome back to another episode of the Afterlife SMP episode 9, I believe. It's episode 9, I think. Hey, look what we got on top of that melon. Can you guess what it is? It's a layout. That's right. You guessed it. Good job. Pat on the back. It is a layout. For what? You don't know. It's a castle. It's a castle. I'll tell you anyway. Anyway, <laughs> welcome back to another episode of The Afterlife. Uh, yeah, today we're going to be talking about lots of things, okay? First, I got to clear out my inventory here. I know, all you OCD people, you're going to be like, oh my god, oh my god, I'm freaking out. He needs to clean out his inventory. He has to do it right now. He needs to do it. <laughs> it's okay. Calm down. We'll be fine. Uh, so yeah, I got a layout down for our castle base. And if you were following me on Twitter, you would have seen that already. You would have been like, oh, Blonsk, I already know. I already know, okay, what it looks like even. You know? So if you follow me on Twitter... Whoa, Hutchie, I thought you were already on the server, buddy. Oh my god. <laughs> That's weird. Um, I didn't know he left. So yeah, if you were following me on Twitter, you would have seen that I uh, posted a design on Twitter of this castle. You would, you would have had the scene, all the uh, stuff. You could still go over there and check my Twitter and be like, oh, Blonsko, that's a cool castle. Uh, so yeah, shameless self-reversion, I guess. I don't know, a little bit. <laughs> Not shameless. But uh, yeah, so we have a castle design here. Uh, six towers uh, and then one in the middle. So that's all seven. And it'll be seven total. Because uh, there's like a middle castle and it has like seven towers on there. Um, or not. No, it doesn't have seven towers. Jesus. It has. The whole castle has seven. The one little one in the middle has one. So it's going to be pretty cool. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, seven plus six is what? It's. Uh, I don't know. It's um, 13. Is that 13? Yeah, it's 13, right? Yeah, 13. Um, so yeah. That'd be 13 towers. Jeez, I can imagine. I can't imagine building that on survival. On creative, pff, piece of cake. Piece of cake. Uh, so, the castle that we're going to be going with... Actually, you know what? Let me jump over to my creative world, and we're going to take a look at the design. And I'll tell you why I'm going to show you it now when we're over there. Alright, and there she blows. That's the castle that we're going to be building. Um, now, the reason why I'm showing you it now, sort of, kind of, uh, is just sort of to give you an idea. Because... This is mainly going to be an off camera project because uh, it's going to take a lot of concentra concentration, not concentration, <laughs> what? Uh, it's going to take a lot of concentration to build this build and I have such a hard time building big buildings while recording. So we're going to do little projects and while in the background, this castle is going to be built off camera. So that's going to be pretty cool. So on camera, we're going to be do doing little projects. This will be getting built in the background of it all. But that's why I want to show you it now is simply because it's going to take a little bit for me to build this on survival. Uh, it took me about 10 hours or 12 hours to build on in creative. And in survival, it's going to take me a little longer than uh, 12 hours. Uh, but as you can see, it's a fully fleshed out castle. Uh, it does not have an interior just yet. But it does have a um, pretty nice looking exterior, I would say. Um, and it's going to make for a great little base and PvP area on uh, on Afterlife. Uh, Hutchie came up with a great idea to do like uh, PvP events here. It would be a great PvP uh, castle. So that's going to be pretty cool. I can't wait for to do that. And, this, and since Hutchie did say that, I was like, you know what? Let me design this around PvP. Let me give it a little bit of that sort of purpose. Uh, so one of the main features that it has is this little area here. Uh, this is a very a good, like, I guess, defense area. Like, having a bow here. Let me just get a bow out real quick. So if you had a bow, right, you could literally have all sorts of angles here. Uh, and I mean, it's not the best because it's really the blocks are in the way, but if you had oncoming enemies, it's great. Uh, and if people are inside the castle, you should, can sort of get some angles this way here. Like up here, you can like stand up here and 
you can shoot if people are inside, you know, uh, if there's a staircase, like somewhere over in that direction, you can kind of knock them off the staircase. So it's, it's really nice for PVP. It also has a second layer here, so you can kind of get up here and shoot the guys down there. Um, it, it's, it's really nice. It is designed pretty much all around it. And then if you're in the towers as well, uh, that sort of makes for a good PVP area. Uh, because then that's just another layer where you could get these guys at. Um, you know, little lines of sights like this, you know, that's really nice. Uh, it's all designed really around the bow. Uh, because the bow is kind of the main, it's the range weapon in Minecraft, so it needs to be. And then you have another little layer up here to where you have pretty much uh, eagle's eyes view of everything over the castle. Uh, which, I don't know if that's true. I think that this tower would be the eagle's eye view of everything. Um, so yeah, this castle's a very, very cool. It's still pretty much a work in progress, though, in creative. Um... I would say, because I still want to do stuff to that little castle, to the middle part over here, the little middle section of the castle, but um, we'll see. We'll have to see where we're going to go with this, but tell me what you guys think of the design. I think it would be really cool to see what you guys think of it. Um, I'm sure most of the responses will be like, oh my god, that's so cool. Uh, I can't wait for it to be built on Afterlife. I hope so, because this castle, to me, is one of my favorite castles that I built. Uh, it has diagonal walls and just everything. I don't usually, stuff I don't usually do. And it's been inspired off of the new Overwatch map, uh, Eichenwall, or whatever it's called. Um, so if you ever play Overwatch, it's inspired off of that castle. Um, so yeah, and hopefully you can see that in a way. I don't know. I don't know if you can. But in the future, I hope to build like a a, diff a bigger wall around it in, on Afterlife. Like we'll build like a, another wall around, and we'll do more with it. We'll build like a little kingdom around it. We'll see. Uh, there's a lot we can do once you have a castle established. I think that's going to be really cool. So let's hop back over on the Afterlife server and let's uh, talk about some more plans over there and what we want to do on the server. Okay, and so now we're back on the Afterlife SMP server. Back to our schedulely regular our regular schedulely programmed or whatever they say on tv um so yeah my one issue with this is that the uh entrance here is dangling my other issue is i do not know where the docks is going to go uh, for the main afterlife spawn uh, a lot of uh, afterlife members were saying either here down by this ocean i assume this is the ocean where we're going to build the docks or um, over there, there's a, another spot over there that they, they want to build it to the east or to the, um, to the south, uh, to the north, I think, pretty sure this is north, no, it's south, that's west, okay, gotcha, gotcha, um, so yeah, pretty cool, like, like the layout, I, I do like it, my only issue is, is with this whole, you know, dangling part, we're gonna have to build a lot of terrain up to it, which can become a big issue. So we'll have to see. We might have to build it on a flat area, which I don't I don't like doing because mountains make everything more epic. If you build something on a mountain, uh, it makes it more epic. We'll just have to see. Um, but this is definitely going to be an off-camera project. I'm not going to do a lot of it on camera, simply simply because it is just too uh, too much on camera. Uh, it's just a big project to do uh, for an on-camera type of thing. Um, so. We'll have to see. We'll have to see where it takes us. Uh, and I'll definitely give a little progress updates uh, with everything that's going on. I'm going to need this coal. I'm going to need it right now. I need to drop off this stone real quick. I do need to go back up there and drop off this stone. Um, because I found a chest full of stone. And I just decided, hey, nobody, nobody looks like they're using this. I could use it. So it was over by uh, Zyro's vault, Zyro Volts. And uh, so... Hopefully it's not in use of something. If it is, I'll give it back. I will. But when I see cobblestone, I need it. I, I'm just going to take it. So beware your chests. Now, obviously, if it's in your house. If this was like a chest that was just laying on the road. With just full of cobblestone. So, I don't know. It's, it's, it just spoke to me. It was like, blonde skunk, use me. Use me, blonde skunk. I need you. It, it just, it felt, I felt... So, like, I felt like a, a father is picking up its newborn baby, and, uh, 
I needed that cobblestone. That's that's what I that's what I need it. You just you gotta understand. You just have to. Um, but anyway, yeah. So we did a live stream yesterday, and we worked on the castle. Uh, so for any of you that did watch that live stream, thank you. Thank you very much. We're going to be doing one later today, uh, depending on when you're watching this video, of course. Uh, but if you're watching this on the day that it got uploaded, there will be a live stream at 2.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, as a, a usual. So if you want to watch a live stream, we're going to be playing some Overwatch. I'm pretty sure that's what we're going to be doing today. If not, then oh well. Either Overwatch or Hearthstone, because I've been really enjoying uh, Overwatch. So, probably going to be Overwatch. We'll see. But anyway, so I th I'm th what I'm thinking here is is that the path is going to come something from over this direction. Because this is the easiest way that I can build a path. Uh, I could do like a little sort of, um, maybe like a bridge or something. I don't know. We could do a bridge. We could do a, a path that sort of wraps around and goes down here. Uh, we can clear out that spot in the mountain. We'll have to see. But the path is definitely going to be coming from over in this direction. So let's head over to um, uh, Blue Cheese and uh, um, Taco Town. Okay? That's what it's going to be called now. Blue Cheese and Taco Town. That's what it is. <laughs> the Shop District. That's what it's called. Alright? Just deal with it. Okay? Blue Cheese and Taco Town. That's what the Shop District is now called. Um, so yeah, a little F3 and A wouldn't hurt, right? There we go. Beautiful. Yeah, I've been having some chunk loading issues, um, on the server. And I think that's just, I think I want to blame it on myself. Because I feel bad if I blame it on the server, because then I feel like I'm blaming it on Jay. Uh, but it's not, I don't think it's the server. I think it's just me. I think it's just my internet connection. So, that's fine. Um... Anyway, so we have Zyra votes here. We have Jack's Chicken Shack of Slaughter. Uh, and then we have, uh, what's his face name? Uh, the One Stop Wondrous Glass Shop. Uh, the One Stop Wondrous Glass Shop. Oh my god, I just came up with a new name for that shop. It's a much, much better. No, <laughs> that's awful. Okay. Uh, welcome to Flocking Flowers. I mean, Frolicking Flowers. And uh, what's this? Uh, Michael's Wool Emporium coming soon. Oh man, I could use that. I really am going to use that. That's going to be great. And the glass shop as well. Uh, and this shop, I think. And maybe Michael's thing uh, here. Maybe. We'll see. It's not filled. I need this. I need it. Oh wait, it is filled. That's the place diamonds here, chess. Uh, we need... I need oak wood. So if you were to stock this up with oak wood and... Where is it? Spruce wood? I mean, I, I mean, I, I will buy everything from you. I will literally just buy you out. Let's check uh, Blonskunk's building company. Uh, let's shut the door in our face, too. Let's check Blonskunk's building company. Uh, hello, welcome to Blonskunk Building Company Services. Uh, building, landscaping, demolition, designing, planning. Don't sign this book. Do not sign it. Do not sign the book. Okay. Ordering example service name. Okay, got it. Okay, Blanskunk will contact you on Skype and discuss the price. Uh, order below. Okay, and there's do order. I still have to talk to him about the order. Um, so you have to find a good time to do that. Anyway, uh, yeah, I also wanted to check out the radio station. I don't know if I checked out the radio station, but it has some interior work done. I like having a neighbor. It's nice, a little neighbor, a little neighboring um, radio station. Uh, it looks nice in here. Great little front desk, looking great. Anything back here? Oh yeah, there is something up here. Well, oh hello, uh, unfinished, scary. Uh, who is future location? Oh, this is where the who is thing is gonna go. That's that's great. That's fantastic. Great, great dude. You're doing great things. Um, lovely. I love the little window design. This is just like a radio station. This is fantastic. What's this? Afterlife recap. <gasps> oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. Oh, yes. Hello. Welcome to the afterlife recap. We're going to be talking about what happened on the server. How you doing? Okay. So, this week, nobody did nothing. Okay, great. Great. Good job. All right. So, anyway. Um, shops are looking great. I love it. It's looking fantastic. We got the, the, the royal chicken up there. 
Everything's looking good. What's this? New plans for Duke? Duke? Is it Duke? Yeah, it's Duke. It's got that duck. Duke. Duke. I don't know how to say that. How do you supposed to be? How do you? What? How do you supposed to do that? Anyway, looking great. I think our path for our castle is going to extend off here. Uh, I think that's going to be really cool. I think this is where, this is the main point why I came over here is just to see. Yeah, so they're going to have a path that comes around this way. Uh, so we can probably extend our path going this way, and it'll go all the way down, down to the castle, and that'll be pretty sick. I'm not going to lie. So that'll be nice if we can get that established. Um, as for the mountain house, I'm not really feeling the mountain house right now. What I'm thinking is, is maybe we could build a house that's a little bit closer to the spawn, like in over here, uh, like in this area, because... I'm not really feeling the mountain house anymore. I don't like the how far away it is. Uh, a lot of the after most members agree, like they think that maybe it could be a little bit too far away for a spawn house. Uh, just because, look at the location of it. I mean, it's pretty dang far away. And I don't like that it's far away. I don't like that I have to keep walking back and forth so much to get to my house. Uh, but it is nice looking. Like, don't get me wrong. Like, looking at it up on the mountain is just fantastic. I love that. That's why I built it up on the mountain. Um, but we might build another house that is closer to spawn. Uh, so we'll see. We'll see what happens. We might work on that in the next episode. Uh, I want to get a design down. We might get, a, like, a little modern house going. I think that would be really cool. Uh, or we might do, like, a little fantasy house. Who knows? We might see. But that's going to do it for this episode, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Uh, sorry that there wasn't anything really um, building wise going on in here, but that you know that'll happen sometimes where we just kind of just talk and do our thing. Uh, but that's gonna do it. As always, offer it to be awesome, and I'll see you guys next time. After life. <laughs> After life, I love the after life. You can't stop me. I love the after life. Ooh, I love after life. You can't stop me from what I'm doing. You want me and I am you. Welcome to after.